And we all know what a nightmare it can be to drive on I-70 in the mountains, especially during <laughs> ski season. But there's fear that traffic could get worse when you factor in driving alongside trucks hauling gravel. And that is why residents reached out to Contact 7 about a proposed mine right off the highway. Liz Gillardi shows us how they're fighting it. My biggest concern is the uh, impact to the quality of life in the valley. A piece of land that is untouched, beautiful, full of wildlife. Why should someone living in the Front Range care about this? Anyone going to the mountains to recreate is going to be impacted by this. He's talking about a proposed gravel mine in the heart of Clear Creek County, right off I-70 in Empire. You probably drive by this stretch, but maybe you never stop to admire it. John Ennix has. He's lived here for more than 30 years. It's just not the best use for the land. And another neighbor says it's not the best location. Just a short climb across the highway is a paradise for kids. It's one of the premier camps, not just in Colorado, but nationwide. The Easter Seals Camp, almost 70 years old, caters to kids with a variety of medical needs. Many are disabled and their health is fragile. All the wind is blowing down, so all that dust will end up right here. We reached out to the mine's operators who are in the middle of a state permitting process. They told me, we know there's a lot of opposition to this and a lot of people don't want this to happen, but we think there is a reasonable path forward. They also told me after this next step with the state, they plan to reconnect with neighbors. We see herds of 50 to 60 elk out there. We see herds of about the same number of bighorn sheep. But they have a different vision. They want to see the land become dedicated open space, protecting what they love about the area. It just makes me peaceful. It's just beautiful. You're looking at the Continental Divide, and it's just... Liz Gillardi, Denver 7.